so we saved the village maybe or maybe we just saved ourselves I guess we just saved ourselves because we're running aren't we so a black horde forms and we're going back keep watch Let's shoot it with an arrow. Wow, okay. So I, I didn't manage to kill it with the arrow. Wow, okay. So that was risky. I Maybe I could have shot her and she would have died. I mean, I don't know. Okay, I don't know what's going on. I think we're trying to escape, but in some incredibly slow and convoluted manner. <laughs> Always warmed up his way out of talking about it. They rarely stop for rest. They'll follow us until we're tired and then they'll attack. <laughs> wow, we're relying on this poor uh, poor giant to save us. I think we need to be a bit more ambitious. But I guess they do appear to be unstoppable. Heroes? I guess this is like camp, but in a bad place. What's this? Oh, that, that's quite sweet. She should wear her own bracelet, I reckon. Anyone leveled up? He needs to kill one more. He hasn't killed anyone. Oh, we've leveled up. Promote. Build higher stats. Increase your item rank. I want the higher stats, I think. What should we go for? I think... Strength is the answer to all problems, it seems. Though we could go with some... Uh, is that our defense, our armor? We could go with spending more points a turn of willpower. Maybe we have more willpower. We haven't run out of willpower yet, but it is decreased, so we'll go with that for now. There we go. What's this? Our oh, items, we don't have any. If she hasn't actually killed one. I thought she had. Echo got one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's loading. What are we going to do? We're going to go to the market and buy. What do we. We pay with renown? Plus one will on rest. Plus one armor on rest. That could be quite handy. We should buy that as well, I think. Sometimes the difference between armor over your shoulders or on the ground is where you keep it sewn together. That's pretty funny. Plus one will on rest. That sounds handy as well. And we'll buy all the supplies we can get. Now we'll go back to heroes. Okay, so we want armor on our melee guy. So Ivor, I guess, should carry the bag of uh, of amazingness. Yeah. Cool. And then, I guess, Rook can carry the one which gives him more... Oh, wait, so I gave the wrong one. Yeah, that's what I meant. So Will to this one, and Armor to this one. That's right. That should help, I think. I don't, I don't really know, it's just a guess. I think we can level them up as well, which, um, yeah, I don't know how that really works, but we'll find out. I guess you get legendary items in a sort of Nordic style in addition to leveling up your heroes. I'm going to go to the Great Hall where I guess we get more people for our caravan. The Chieftain. Ugh. Okay, don't stop worrying. Dredge milling around. Chieftain's wife finds us. She's some sort of archer as well. 
all girls archers in this, that's a bit sexist. What would you do in my place? I'd have left by now, <laughs> they're already outside the doors. They're quite slow, I think. I think they will overrun us, so we should get going. He imagined us fighting back and saving the town. I didn't think that was going to happen, so I think we should get going. Frostvella is where we need to go, it has walls. That seems wise. Nobody left behind. <laughs> uh, I don't think you, you should die either. I think we need to um, carefully go. He doesn't want us to burn the town. Shall we create a distraction or will we get killed? We should probably do it though in a heroic style. Because you know, these guys look pretty heroic. We will create a distraction. Okay, yeah, so they're not planning on dying. Some random woman's going to come with us. Apparently she's trained the other girl, which I guess is helpful. So, I assume we have to do some sort of delaying action. Which might be tricky, because I have no idea how to play the game. But you know, we're, we're heroes. I want Gil with us. If something happens, I need him to tell the chieftain. Yeah, she can come with us. Okay, we're not going to fight them, we're just going to get their attention. Okay, we're going to kill a few and the rest will follow. So, Trigvi is injured. We haven't actually got anyone else to fight instead, so I guess we'll just stick with who we've got. Maybe we'll sh switch the order since he's injured. Okay. I think that'll work. I probably could have rested in the hall. Maybe that was a decision option and that would have healed the spearman. So maybe that was a mistake. But you know, it's too late now to change my mind. Okay. So I guess we'll have to fight wave after wave of these guys. What have we got then? Dredge Grunt, Dredge Grunt. I think this is the one which brings hordes and is the really tough one. So what we'll want to do is we'll want them to slowly come towards us, I guess. Well, maybe it would be good to have a bit of range so we can fall back. That's what I was thinking. There is four, so they'll get two extra moves on us. These ones have little armor. He has little armor as well. Um, we should be able to fit there, shouldn't we? Let's go. Okay, so we're just out of range of them. So. If we rest, we'll gain. I don't know if we can gain above our value. We'll find out in a minute. Looks like you can. Oh, you can. Okay. We can stonewall, though. Although it costs one of our initiative points. So it's probably not worth doing right now. How do I cancel an order? That's how we do it. Okay. So he'll rest as well. He's probably going to summon some beasts. Is it like a timer? I don't really understand. Rook. Could take a shot from here. I think. I think that's in range. Should begin softening them up if possible. Took some armor off. Okay, they're getting pretty close. <laughs> we could just charge in. That would be just typical of, of my, my current standards in this game. He'll wait there. So they, they keep coming on it looks like, which might buy us some time. I think we do have to kill some though, so 
bit more armor down with our archers. Then we next get a melee guy, we can try and land a hit. Who's moving next? Which one's this? The, oh, you can see their movement. Okay, so this guy will reach us. She has a useful ability. What's her range of her attack? So she's one, two, three, maybe four tiles out of range. So how far can we move towards them? Just probably two. It's probably worth moving just behind our shield wall though. And then we can attack... Who's moving afterwards? The big one and then the front one. So... We can attack this front one, get rid of a bit more of his armour. Everyone on our team has now moved, unfortunately. Someone's going to take a hit here. Probably Rook, unfortunately. Oh, Big hit. He's in trouble. Take a step forward. And then... We can strike this guy. Oops, wrong one. Attack this guy. Oh, we're going down to one health right away. It's not bad. Guess he can keep summoning more guys. I oh, know he's going to come forward and attack us now. Might be worth killing one, I guess. Though, so, waste one of their moves next turn, so it might be worth. Is he moving next? No, he is. Then he is. Okay. So we could kill this one. We could weaken this one. I think we'll weaken the front one. Because we don't know how long this fight is going to continue. Uh oh. <laughs> I just left this guy completely exposed. Oops. Who's moving next? That guy over there. That guy there. Then this one. Oh, is he different? I don't think he is. He just has a slightly different looking face. Okay, Mark does one armor damage and all allies within range automatically hit this target. That might be handy. Mark him. No. 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 I want you to use Mark on this guy. Yeah. I think that should get everyone to attack him. Oh, that is pretty amazing actually. I should try and use that more often. Okay, so we can kill this guy as well, I think. Might be a good idea. We need to save, uh, what's his name? This guy. <laughs> what's his name? Oh dear. I'm so bad. Just so bad. <sighs> okay. Is he in range? I think he's just out of range, unfortunately. So that was a mistake. This guy's going to come forward and kill him. He is in serious trouble. Okay, he's dead, actually. So, ultra serious trouble. Okay, who's moving next? This guy. Irrelevant. This guy. Okay. So what we'll do is... We need to attack him. So we could either deal probably 3 damage, bring him down to 7, or we could go straight for his armour for 2. Probably worth reducing his armour a little bit more. Okay, we'll move the big guy in, just because he can actually soak up a small amount of damage. And if we can deal 3 damage to the big one, that might help us. Okay, we need to move forward. What's what's that? Oh, that's because he's injured, yeah, okay. So we can move forward to here at the moment. Not in range of doing the mark again, which is amazing. But in range to deal could deal armor damage to that guy, or we could kill this little guy. It's probably worth doing. Oh no, we can't kill him, oops. We can do quite a bit of damage. 
Oh, he took that. That's pretty good. Spearman's probably going to get taken out again here. We can take out this guy though. Oh, he got his promotion. Okay, so now it's two on one. Two guys with lots of armor left against our guys. What we still want to do is move there so we can get the double hit in. So we need to reduce his armor. Oops. Reduce his armor. Because he can summon more. So he's the one we need to take out. I guess we have to defeat all of them to win this. I thought we just had to hold out. Oh, we're going to lose some more guys here. Oh dear. So at the moment we can reduce his armor a little bit more. So we can afford to probably lose one more guy, maybe. Keep going. So Ivor can probably do a fair amount of damage here. Eight. That's pretty solid. That might give him a chance. Oh, he's going to do a summoning thing. Okay, we need to strike him now. Not sure any of them are in range though. Oh, but he can kill him. Excellent. Rook is amazing. I guess he is the main hero though. Spear guy's guess getting battered to death. He could go with his, uh, his special ability though, couldn't he? So knock him backwards. Make him bleed. Okay. Go pump out attacks with all the willpower we have just to try and keep him down. There we go. We defeated the dredge. Go us. They weren't so tough. Well, okay, we lost the little guy, whatever his name is, El Elgin or, or something. Oh. <sighs> So we lost them in the woods. We wait for the caravan. Some people were wounded and some are missing. Oh dear. Oh, the chieftain's dead. Oh, let's hand in our arm. Our hand. That's a sweet story, I guess. Though she's almost certainly going to die with me looking after her. Pause to catch your breath. You can't see the caravan stretch up. Can't see those bringing up the rear. Uh oh. Should I rally the caravan with a speech? We probably need to, if we can. You make way to the rear, hoist up a child, and give a speech. They push themselves a bit harder. That's that's good. I think uh, I could have rested to heal up my guy, but I just sort of wanted us to uh, not get into another fight with a load of giant stones, stone beasts. Those giant stones, yeah. Well, they sort of do look like uh, giant stones, just shaped like people. Oh dear, our caravan, all these people to look after. We have 270 clansmen with 45 fighters. Though it seems like there's only like six of us who actually do any fighting. Ivor thinks we should rest. What are we doing? <laughs> Oh, apparently we have to hold them together. But you're the dredge killer around here. That's probably what I, I would probably say. Alright, so it's racism. Fair enough. Let her handle it if it's easier for you. Why, well, it's appealing to my masculine uh, pride. What am I supposed to do? Lie, tell them everything's going to be alright. Oh dear. Wow, I need to pull it together apparently. Okay. Hey, don't be too mean, you giant. <laughs> Seems like we don't get along that well, even though really we do seem to get along well. Maybe he's just teasing me. The godstone looms overhead. Inspect the stone. The word the stone doesn't see many visitors. 
Not much reason to travel so far east. When hunters come through, they sometimes stop to give offerings out of habit more than anything else now that the gods are dead. So this Hridvaldir guy was a god of hunters and of wild beasts. Both a man and a wolf. Always depicting Efty with his terrible spear. We could do with his spear. He probably wouldn't be happy about his woods being full of dredge. Oh, she made me a necklace. Well, that's sweet. I don't, not sure what I make of this uh, romance myself, but yeah. Don't know why she had such bad dreams. She was fine. Everyone was fine. Apparently that was an achievement, so achievement's pretty cheap. <laughs> Just need to wander over and look at like uh, some stones. Here we go, wandering across the land. It's quite a nice little indie game. I like the style. The caravan halts when a group of men appear on the trail, weapons at their feet. Oh, these people want to join us. I think we should let them join us just because we near more manpower. They're probably bandits. Okay, that's handy. They probably could have betrayed us, but I thought, like, even if they're bandits, you know, common enemy, giant stone, like, uh, immortal killing creatures coming after them, they probably work with us. A brawl erupts. Okay, so some guy caused a drunken, like, uh, incident. I think we should just tie him up until he dries out. I don't think we really need to go all the way to, like, you know, completely punishing people. It's a hard time. Yeah. Our village got overrun, so probably this village is going to get overrun, like, shortly. I would imagine, anyway. It's hard to tell. Who understands the motivations of these, uh, these dredge creatures? So we can talk to, to Blondie or Spear Guy. Let's talk to the spear guy. Guess I better thank you for helping us out. He doesn't care. Nice beard. Uh. <laughs> I think um, Shrugby might be a mental case. Yeah, people do lie, that's true. <laughs> He's not wearing a helmet, so apparently we can trust him. I've got to go. It wasn't all madness, though. It would be good if we could train some people to fight. <laughs> wow, this guy is just um, insane. Okay. <laughs> Let's have a word with the, the other guy. How's the arm? Yeah, we did We did just let him get beaten to death by a giant uh, stone man. Yeah, it took some extremely hard hits. He's great. We haven't talked much. We can call him Gil. Egil. I was close. Ah. Never seen a shield like that before. Solid metal. Wow. That must be pretty heavy. Normally they're made of wood, I think. But I'm not sure. So he can be our defense guy, I guess. Oh, he likes her. I guess compliment him by accident, just by accidentally clicking. Off I go. Okay. So all's good. I think we need to drop by the market and buy, oh, 20% dodge strength attacks plus 2 strength. Plus 3 armor on rest, that's pretty good. Pretty expensive though. Drawing aggro. Might be handy for our big guy.
I think it's worth getting that Obsidian Bell actually for our big guy. He gets aggro, gets more armor and rest, and he gets increased strength. So I'll buy that. I'll buy some supplies. I'll buy all, all the supplies he has. Because we just need supplies. Now we can look at our heroes. This might be boring, but you know, you can skip it. Who's leveled up? Ivor's leveled up. Oh, whoops. Cancel. Okay, there's no cancel. Maybe there is. Okay, so what we want to do... Where's their items? We can give... We can give Egg all the uh, magic thingy. What does this actually do? Dodge strength attacks. Oh, we gave him the armor repair. But I want to swap that. Oh, we'll promote him for now. Build higher stats. Oh, we, we forgot that we needed Renown to actually upgrade our guys. What a mistake. Critical error. Oh well. Can we close the promotion thing for now? Yeah, okay. Do we want the will on rest? We probably do. Let's close that for now. Oop. Oop. Oops. Back. Okay, let's do this properly. We want him to carry the uh, Obsidian Bell I bought. Oh, it costs rank 5, wow. Okay, never mind. Okay, who's rank 2? Just Rook. Okay. And we'll give him his rune, which is rank 2, just because he can. We can give her the, the leather flask for now. Yeah, we need. We probably need to rest. Oops, did I press that too many times? I think we can. Let's rest. Let's check our heroes. I think everyone's fully fit now. I should have saved some of that renown to level up. Critical error, I know, sorry. Not really that used to the game mechanics. I guess it's time to get a move on. We've got some rest to heal up the party. We need to keep moving to stay away from the uh, the dredge hordes. Hogan and Mogan. Many from the village wish to join you to phosphor. Okay, some guy's very angry. Oh, okay. They've been trying to divide the village since you got here. You can keep whoever wants to stay and die. Okay, I think people should be allowed to leave. Let your people decide on your own, seems reasonable. He doesn't even think there is any dredge. Oh, they're significantly outnumbered. A side of the brothers. They just want their freedom to leave. Okay, let's not hear. Should we get Hogan and Mogan uh, help us out? We can give um, Eggle and Mad Spear Person a break. Have the twin brothers uh, handle this. Let's see how it goes. I think I put them in for swords, guys. I guess not the archer women. Oh well, we'll see how it goes. They're not giant stone men, so it should be alright. So there's an archer and a few isolated shield people. So. Our big guy can challenge the two there. The two brothers can take on this guy. And this guy can take on that guy. Let's handle this. So we want to head towards this archer. Incredibly slowly. 
guess maybe they're slower than the humans. Who are they gonna shoot? Alright, they are going for him. Wait, the twin brothers to just stop pounding on some guy. Oh no, don't end turn. Nope, attack. We can do 3 damage to their armor. That's pretty good. We're just going to slow this guy down. Have a little. So we'll soften up his actual attack. Just so he can't penetrate. Oh, there's another one here. I missed him. Oops. Okay, he's going to take a bit of a pounding here, actually. That might be a mistake. But I want to take out the archer woman. This guy could cause some damage here, though. Reduce his strength a bit more. There we go. Okay. So if we reduce their armor, we can easily get a killing blow. But quite often it can be good just to drain them, I think. Okay, we can't actually quite reach him. That's a bit annoying. What, is, what does Bloody Flail do? Plus one for each adjacent ally. That sounds quite handy, actually. If we get a chance. So we weaken this guy. He shouldn't do too much damage. Always went for the armor though. So the archer's gonna go soon. Who's this guy? Raider. He's the one on the bottom. How much health has he got? Nine. We could move down, but I think it's better to go for the archer at the moment. Could break her armor, and then our big guy should get the chance next. So probably best. Move forward. And we can just kill her. Not bad. Of course it means I get another move, so maybe it wasn't best. Ooh, three of the armor down. That's quite a lot. So we're gonna run this guy down with the two crazy brothers. They just wanted their freedom, so just had to help them. Oh dear, they're going to kill Rook with their, like, oh my god, he's in trouble. What should we do here? Can mark him to do five, or we could just leg it. I'm tempted to just leg it. Luckily his special ability actually um, actually would still work even if he was quite badly strength inhibited on the bright side. Let's kill this guy. Oh, it's mostly armor unfortunately. Oh well. So, who do we need to soften up? This guy is going to make a move, then this guy. This guy could kill Rook, so it's probably best for us to shoot him. Just to decrease the damage a little. Oh my god, they're going to kill him. <laughs> oh, I'm down! I'm down! Oh well. It's time that we ran through some of these guys, I think. One down. Ouch. We're down to six. We could kill one. It's probably better to de armor this guy. Although we're getting de armor quite fast ourselves. 
So it's going to take a while to get back into the fight. I probably shouldn't have spread out quite so much. We should be able to win, though. It's actually going worse than our fights with the dredge, just because there's more of them, I guess. But we can pull back in this direction, I suppose. So, who's going to go next? This guy. Back here. He's going to kill that guy, probably. Then this guy. So we probably want to decrease the armor on that guy. Oh, whoa. That is a lot of damage. Bring him down to one. Well, they're draining our armor fast, though. These guys are just charging forwards. Sadly, it means this guy's just going to get killed while we were trying to get, get there. I guess Eggles could run. It'll buy us some time. Use up some of their um, willpower. So we can move to here. That guy has nine. What could we use? We could use our bloody flail to get rid of his armor. It's pretty solid. Oh, they're doing the same thing back to us. Punishing. So who's going to go next? The, the middle guy? Is that? Okay. Guess we need to weaken him. Oh, our big guy's taking a pounding actually. He's almost lost all his armor. Who's going to go next? The guy back there, then this guy, then the middle guy. We should probably just kill the middle guy. All armor's gone. Things are getting ugly, guys. If we go here, and then... Oh, maybe we should, we should get some of our thingies back. There we go, we can do four now. Oh, they're pounding us. This guy is just in serious trouble. Who's going to go next? This guy, this guy, this guy. So we should kill their strongest guy. We've almost got them. Okay, let's take out their three willpower guy, if we can. Ooh, he's got a chance of blocking, unfortunately. Oh well, only ten percent. I think that's her first kill. Ooh, almost drained all his armor. I think he's got him. Okay, that was tougher than I expected, and we did just murder a load of villagers. Might not be the best. Might not have been the best choice. Probably didn't need to murder all the villagers. And we did just we just murdered them and walked off. Hogan returns and his son's wife. Apparently Alette wandered off because apparently she didn't like that. Should be fair enough. I mean, yeah. Should we make cap? Odd life approaches us. Gathers up the long banner from the caravan and pass it to Alette. What's this about? Sew up the banner. Are we the dad? Okay. That makes more sense. What a misunderstanding. I thought she was our love interest. Very cute. Oh. The story of the family. I wish she was here. 
story about our family is short, understandably. Why do I have to kill those men in the village? Uh, they would have killed other guys, that's true. No, it's okay not to want to kill anyone. She'd do it if she really had to, which is good. Story of Skogra. Has that been added to it? How amusing. Sort of like a family quilt or something like that. Okay, yeah, I was thinking about resting. But I think what we need to do... Oh no, we don't need to do training. Oops. Oops. Undo. Undo the training. So you can practice fight with your guys, but there's not much point at the moment. Let's go back to camp. No, no, I want to go back. Oh well, it looks like we might have to fight this, so I'll just skip this, I guess. Save you some time. So, we saved the village, maybe. Or maybe we just saved ourselves. I guess we just saved ourselves because we're running, aren't we? So a black horde forms, and we're going back. Keep watch. Let's shoot it with an arrow. Wow, okay. So I, I didn't manage to kill it with the arrow. Wow, okay. So that was risky. I, maybe I could have shot her and she would have died. I mean, I don't know. Heroes? I guess this is like camp, but in a bad place. What's this? Oh, that, that's quite sweet. She should wear her own bracelet, I reckon. Anyone leveled up? He needs to kill one more. He hasn't killed anyone. Oh, we've leveled up. Promote. Build higher stats. Increase your item rank. I want the higher stats, I think. What should we go for? I think strength is the answer to all problems, it seems. So we could go with some, uh, is that our defense, our armor? We could go with spending more points a turn of willpower. Maybe we have more willpower. We haven't run out of willpower yet, but it is decreased, so we'll go with that for now. There we go. What's this? Our oh, items, we don't have any. If she hasn't actually killed one, I thought she had. Echo got one. Yeah. Okay. Okay, it's loading. What are we going to do? We're going to go to the market and buy. What do we. We pay with renown? Plus one will on rest. Plus one armor on rest. That could be quite handy. We should buy that as well, I think. Sometimes the difference between armor over your shoulders or on the ground is where you keep it sewn together. That's pretty funny. Plus one will on rest. That sounds handy as well. And we'll buy all the supplies we can get. Now we'll go back to heroes. Okay, so we want armor on our melee guy. So Ivor, I guess, should carry the bag of uh, of amazingness. Yeah. Cool. And then I guess Rook can carry the one which gives him more. Oh, it's I gave the wrong one. Yeah, that's what I meant. So, will to this one and armor to this one. That's right. That should help, I think. I don't, I don't really. Okay, I don't know what's going on. I think we're trying to escape, but in some incredibly slow and convoluted manner. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Always warmed up his way out of talking about it. They rarely stop for rest. They follow us until we're tired and then they'll attack. <laughs> wow, we're relying on this poor, uh, poor giant to save us. I think we need to be a bit more ambitious. But I guess they do appear to be unstoppable. <laughs> 